Hello, my name is Dr. Heather Kleiner Hancock, and I am a PhD scientist devoted to finding cures for cancer. My other passion is training our next generation of biomedical scientists. Today, what I want to tell you about is the cutting edge research that we're doing right here in Northwest Louisiana at LSU Health Shreveport. In my lab here at LSU Health Shreveport, we study neurodegenerative diseases such as Alzheimer's and Parkinson's disease. The purpose of my research is to improve upon the tests that are used to help develop new compounds that are currently beyond the reach of doctors and scientists. In our lab, we can affect the function of the brain by introducing genes in specific regions of the central nervous system. In this way, using these approaches, we can study normal brain function and also what goes wrong during neurological diseases. And we are proud to be working on such an important problem. I have a laboratory that examines breast cancer pathogenesis and we looked at how protein dysregulation can lead to cancer growth. The basic scientists and the clinical scientists work hand in hand and then what they discover could be translated into clinical practice, whether it's medication or understanding the biology of the disease. So the collaboration between basic science and clinical science is really important. Clinical research is very important because it helps us to uh, develop new drugs, new types of therapy in order to treat a variety of different diseases. The company I founded, Embera Neurotherapeutics, is engaged in clinical research with the hopes of finding better treatments for addiction. Our drugs, by blocking the body's stress response, is interfering with the ability of those triggers in the environment that then leads to craving and relapse. So right now we're in the process of doing toxicology studies and manufacturing the compound in order to do a larger clinical trial. There are so many people that are suffering from addiction, and if I can help just one person, then it's all been worthwhile to me. At LSU Health Shreveport, uh, we have several departments that have clinical trials because that's the way that we test new therapies, whether it's drugs or devices, to find new cures for diseases and basically to help people live longer. Initially, you have your physician coming to you and talking to you about every aspect of what they want to do with you. Again, whether it's to uh, try a new medication with you or to try some sort of new device with you. And you are given all the information that you need to make an informed decision about whether this is right for you. We need people to volunteer for clinical trials so that we can help uh, develop these new therapies and um, help others beyond ourselves. I strongly believe it is important to encourage students with a curiosity about nature and biological mechanisms in order to foster future discovery and innovation. I'm a senior at Southwood High School and I'm in the BioStart program and we work with the mentors and lab experts at LSU Health Shreveport. I get to come to the lab and enjoy science. The program is of mutual benefit both to the student and the scientist here at the hospital. I think the students learn some great skills that will help them in their careers either in a medical research setting or applicable to whatever career path they choose. Certainly it helps us, they come in, they're, they're a great pair of hands and they often have an innate curiosity and an excitement about the research that really is motivating for us as mentors and drives the research forward. By now, hopefully, you've seen how the different components of medical research can all contribute to the advancement of cures for diseases that affect us all. And we are so excited to bring our younger generation into this pioneering process that includes basic, translational, and clinical research.